What's going on guys, Marty and welcome guys back to the latest uh, Minecraft news update. So today guys, I'm going to be talking about a uh, little about actually the Minecraft launch. I'm going to explain how you install it and all that stuff. And I'm going to talk about uh, the confusion that is going on at the moment between uh, the snapshot and the pre-release. So first of all guys, you need to come to this website here, the mojang.com. And then uh, when you come to this website here, just scroll down until you get to the latest uh, Minecraft update, which is going to say 1.5.2 pre-release and 13W17A snapshot update. The reason why they have actually released it to update this week uh, is because 1.5.2 pre-release has got so many updates uh, you know from the previous snapshots and all that stuff and they actually realized straight away they have a few bugs here and there so literally at the same time they released a 13w17a because i think probably would have taken them slightly longer to update the 1.5.2 and then make another release of it and it wouldn't really kind of sounds good if they pre-release the same updates twice doesn't really make any sense and i think they are planning on in the next full release is going to be 1.5.3 but it's going to be the full release and for that reason why they have actually released a 1.5.3 and then pre-release and straight after that it was a snapshot because they don't want to ruin the excitement of the full release of the 1.5.2 which is going to be soon i hope all of that made sense because it took me a bit of time to kind of understand why and then i realized because there were so many bugs and they had to kind of update them and this is why they released the 13w17a so much information to go there and understand but uh, this is exactly what happened and hopefully that made any sense to you guys i'm not sure so um, as you can see these are some of the bugs which uh, were found in the 1.5.2 and they were actually updated in the 13w17a so in here guys if you're going to only download uh, the client you're going to get the 1.5.2 and you don't want this because you're going to end up with a ton of bugs i know there's going to be a few bugs here in there in the 13w17a uh, but that should be fine not as much as the one in 1.5.2 i'm going to actually list down in the video description all the bugs that are available in uh, the latest minecraft update i suppose so um in here guys if you actually scroll down to this bit here when you see this sort of zombie wearing a helmet and this new block texture at the back which i'm going to explain and show you in a second uh, you're going to be able to download the new minecraft launcher so this is another things which a lot of people got confused about last week and i'll receive a ton of messages and emails people are you know asking about what's going on with a new launcher we don't really understand it can you please help us to install it because we have no idea how to install it and all that stuff so i thought it would be nice to kind of show you exactly how to install it and how the whole things kind of work so here guys you have it for the three different operating system windows mac and linux i'm going to go ahead and download the one for windows because this is what i'm actually running so i'm going to click on that and then download it i have already done that i have got a version of it in here so all you have to do when you download it is just drag it into your desktop or go to whatever folder you've kind of saved it to and then drag it into here and then just close the website you no longer want this and then now we have to do is double click on the minecraft dev and this is yes the new minecraft launcher just in case if you haven't actually downloaded it from last week this is the way it kind of look and you still have the old stuff in here you know stuff that you've just updated and all that stuff on the left but on the right now you have the sign in in the corner here as you can see it's like a little uh, new window in here as you can see and in the top here we have the version yes now we can actually backdate to the 1.5.1 i was hoping if we could go slightly more further back but unfortunately the earliest we can go to at the moment is the 1.5.1 and we can see the latest minecraft snapshot update which is super freaking easy you no longer have to do this manually you don't have to download the minecraft.jar manually and then drag it and then paste it and it'll do all that stuff very complicated and many people did not understand how the whole process works so now all you have to do just come to the version click on the snapshot and then of course put your username password and then hit play and that now should download the latest at minecraft and after the download is finished i think it's because it's already done from before uh, it would take about a minute or two and then when it's done it would install and then you get your lovely minecraft launcher now you could close this one here it's fine and then you could just open this up to the full screen and enter your word as usual but now as you can see in the corner here we have the 13w17a which is the latest minecraft update and uh, which is the latest minecraft snapshot update i suppose so right guys now i'm actually in minecraft and i want to show you the new stuff which they have added and it tweaked in minecraft later update so first of all guys you need to find yourself some clay and dig them out uh when you have enough uh, find yourself a crafting table only if i could get out of here or you could actually use your little inventory just to make some uh, clay blocks like so so most of you guys probably already know how to make this so when you have enough clay blocks like so uh, go to a furnace 
and this is the new hardened clay block so find a furnace place down your clay blocks and this is how you get your a new lovely hardened clay block and you do actually get some xp from smelting your uh, hardened clay block and you could pretty much use it as a stone so yeah this is pretty much the new block and it's got the same sound effect as a normal stone and you need the pickaxe to mine it as well so i think now it's time to go into the next things which they have added in the last update actually they have tweaked in the last update i suppose some uh, already have extra spawn eggs so let me go into um yep creative mode otherwise i'm gonna get killed really fast and let me make this night all right so if i actually spawn now some zombies um yep now i can spawn them so if i just spawn a lot of zombies wow this is really high and now they actually socialize together so they pretty much stay in groups and if you actually attack one of them they will actually all come after you like the zombie pigments so they have actually pretty much uh, added this sort of option from the zombie pigments into the normal zombies and i think it's more realistic i suppose when you attack one they should all attack you i suppose um, which is kind of crazy and cool at the same time but it's much harder now when you actually attack in zombies so you got to be very careful even though this one here is like hmm, enjoying looking at the moon there doesn't really care so this is pretty much the update guys i hope you guys enjoyed it other from you know a ton of uh, bug fixes and all that stuff actually one more things and uh, let me go into um uh, yeah daytime they have actually made deserts to look more like deserts i suppose so what they mean by this they have made it more sort of you know you have like a larger flat space and then sort of like mountains and uh, they have reduced the amount of water that you find in uh, deserts but you probably just find like one larger ponds every i don't know god knows how many blocks uh but uh you don't really find water as much as before in deserts that's what they meant by they have made deserts more like deserts, I suppose. So this is pretty much all the update, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And yeah, more cactuses actually spawns now in desert as well. So yeah, this is pretty much the update, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. A like is very much appreciated. And please don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you guys later. Take care for now. And bye-bye. Peace.